Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Late Night Part 8. I believe it's 8. Yes, it is. Okay, Part 8. So yeah, um, it's been actually quite a while since I have played Late Night. And basically what happened was, um, after I filmed the last part, um, oh my gosh, after I filmed the last part, um, I guess my game like didn't save anything which is really annoying because I was like, come on, like, I went through all of this trouble of, like, you know, like, doing everything, um, and, like, getting everything perfect and ready, so I basically had to go back in and, like, redo every single scenario, like, you know, had, I, I believe he's broken up with Daisy, I believe I got that done, but anyway, for the most part, everything is back to normal, and the way it was, he is still in his relationship with, um, with, what's her name, Emmy, and, um, yeah, so everything is back to normal. The band is actually scheduled to play today instead of Friday, so, so that's why, like, the days are off. Um, that's why. But anyway, he had, you know, some public woohoo, because, yeah, you know, that's Blaine. And, um, actually, another thing happened. He kind of started, um, you know, hanging out with, uh, not Emmy Star, but anyway, Emmy Star is his girlfriend, and I forgot the other girl's name, but anyway, Emmy Star is his girlfriend, and, um, you know, she, she's pregnant with, you know, I, you know, to be honest, I kind of forgot, like, where I ended this part, so, yeah, I believe she already had her baby off camera, and I don't think I showed you guys, maybe I did, oh my gosh, I seriously, like, don't remember what, what I filmed last, but anyway, basically Blaine is in like a lot of you know oh look look it's like little look. anyway um basically Lane Lane oh my gosh Blaine is a romantic interest with Lola Bell and she is a five-star celebrity and you know um after Emmy had um you know like their kid and everything he I don't know he kind of felt like he was old for some reason like he felt like now he's you know like tied down and everything so he kind of made a bad decision and um you know, met this girl, Lola Bell, and they kind of got to talking, and, um, now they're a romantic interest, and he, like, doesn't know how to tell Emmy that, you know, like, that he's been cheating on her, and they did have a daughter, and her name is Lucy, and I'm kind of glad it's Lucy, just because, um, you know, like, sometimes the game generates, like, really, like, really weird names, like, you know, like a really random like blah, 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 like like all those really weird names that like make no sense at all but yeah so now um lucy is the daughter of blaine and um obviously lydia is her aunt and lydia is also dating um emmy's husband so i don't know where that's gonna go but yeah and um our gig is actually today like i told you guys See, I don't know, like, what I want to do with Blaine because, um, because, like, now he's dating Lola, or he's not dating her, but now he's, like, a romantic interest with her, so I don't know, like, where all this is gonna go, but we will figure this out down the line, and, like, poor Scarlet doesn't have, like, a lot of drama in her life, which, I mean, I guess is actually, like, really good for her, just because, you know, she's not, like, one for drama, but I feel like maybe we should, like, try to find her a man, or, like, maybe try to get her, like, a new appearance, or, like, a new gig or something, I don't know, but I really do want to change up Lydia's hairstyle. I think I'll do that off camera or maybe in the next part. I can kind of like have them go down to the salon and um, do that. So, oh, and also um, I actually had her meet, um, what's his name? Like, I, be, I believe it's, Eb oh my gosh, Ebenezer. Um, like that guy that I said I liked at the um, party and I thought that would be a good, um, you know, like kind of mix for, um, Lydia and so they actually met at a party so I'm sorry no, no no I'm sorry no 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 off camera I might have them become friends so so yeah so we're gonna go ahead and ask him out and hopefully he says yes let's go ahead and wait for this oh he's, she's made up some little drinks we might as well go ahead and drink those all right so Blaine had lost the case and had to pay 1,968 simoleons in legal fees okay so poor Blaine he's like you know now we lost a thousand simoleons so we still have quite a lot of money and you know like I feel like you can be so cool like if the whole family could like go in there and kind of like testify for him be like no 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 it's okay you know like he didn't do anything wrong so we're actually gonna go ahead and head over and we're going to 
get out of the courtroom. We are going to pay off paparazzi or like deflect the scandal. We're going to, what do I want to do? We're going to pay off paparazzi. No, 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 no. We should do what we know. We should deflect the scandal over to Lola. Or no, no, not, not well, no, no. We're not going to do that to Lola. We're going to deflect it over to probably Alan just because, you know, like he is, um, his girlfriend's like ex-husband and I guess Blaine like you know Blaine does not like him so we are going to go on ahead and deflect the scandal over to him okay so now like basically the scandal just goes um to Alan and then Alan will have like that scandal on him and then we won't be publicly disgraced any longer <sighs> so yeah and our gig is at um oh he's like hates himself too he's like oh come on man you could better than this so we're going oh oh look at that it's gone that, that was so weird all right well anyway um yeah it just like vanished okay so our gig is at 12 and i don't believe you can actually get there early so i will probably um like kind of fast forward just until it is gig time just because this is basically you know like our preparation and everything for the gig so yeah um let's go and see Okay, so she wants to play the piano in, uh, okay, so um, in the last part, Scarlett actually got, or maybe it was off camera, but she got a um, opportunity to actually play the piano at a, um, like at a music place at like the movie theater, which I thought was really, really cool. So we might have to go over there and do that. Okay. Da -da -da. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we are going. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, so don't forget you have a gig at 12 p.m. Okay, we are not going to forget about our gig because it's our first gig, and I believe we get paid actually a pretty good amount of money. And everybody is like aging up so fast in these LPs. So we are definitely going to have to like, you know, reset them and everything. But I don't know if I want to reset them at a young adult age or if I want to reset them at a adult age. Um, probably an adult age just because, you know. I don't know. I mean, like, it's part eight, and, like, they're already going to become adults. So maybe I will kind of, like, move them back to young adults again just because, like, they are moving, they are aging up so fast. Logan has work in an hour. No, Logan, you're not going to work. We're going to call in sick to work. We're going to take days off of work. I don't even know what we're going to do. We're just going to call in sick or do whatever we have to do. So let's go on ahead and have her do the exact same thing and get time off just because – we do not need to be like in the middle of the gig and all of a sudden you know like oh work's calling like no we are we are living our rock star dreams we don't want to go to work all right so she made up some pancakes okay and it's currently 11 25 so i wonder if we can head over there now i'm going to go ahead and like fast forward until it is 12 p.m <sighs> okay okay we can actually go visit so we're gonna go ahead and visit the huts so that we can like you know be there when um like at least like be on our way before our gig starts okay I'm just wait till like the clock goes to 12 p.m okay we got three minutes two minutes one all right so 12 p.m all right we're gonna go ahead and go to our gig location scarlet urban is on the way and should be there soon good 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 okay so hopefully people are on their way and they're ready to go and also I don't know if I showed you guys this. I think I probably did, but um, you can actually ride in a limo, which I think is actually really, really, really cool because they're, oh, looks like this place is going to be hopping till the wee hours of the night. Yes. So good. This will like a little bit of on, oh my gosh, seriously, cannot speak today at all, at all. I'm like, I have filmed three videos today. And I'm doing the, like the same three videos. And like, I'm doing an audio for like all three videos today. So, um, yeah so if like if every single one of my recent upload videos you guys hear me say i cannot speak it's all on that same day so so yeah apparently the, the ghost bartender back there that's nice um where are you guys like seriously get your butts over here logan this is like this is your gig we're like we're already an hour late go 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 and our genre that we will be playing is rock music just because i feel like we are like a rock music kind of band let's see i wonder if we can oh no okay we have to wait for logan to get here He's taking his sweet time getting getting his butt over here. Okay. No way. Lady Roberts, welcome, welcome. Okay, so apparently she got a discount on her, what is this, like nachos, onion rings, onion rings. Why is she eating onion rings with a fork? I don't understand. Okay, anyway. Anyway. 
well I guess, I guess you could I guess you could eat them either way like with your hands or with your fork but um yeah okay seriously Logan you are taking your sweet time buddy seriously like just get in here all right here we go pick up his guitar Dun, dun. all right now they're all gonna come over here and play play their um parts so logan haynes just played a gig he'll always remember the joy of getting to rock out to an audience no matter how small it is okay seriously there's nobody here like even the bartender left guys even even the bartender left we are seriously playing for nobody that is really 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 sad okay well all right well i mean at least we got a gig so that's all we care about. And hopefully later on, I mean, it says we're a hot spot, but hopefully later on um, in our like band experience, we can actually, um, you know, like play for larger crowds. Oh, and look, we actually like brought in somebody. Yay. Hopefully like she stays for a while so we can have like a little bit of an audience. But yeah, Lydia is currently non non-existent. She's just, you know, invisible. But yeah, this is them rocking out to their, um, you know, gig performance and i actually had the volume on um and then it, like cut out so yeah this they did not sound they did not sound good guys i am like i am like dead serious they did not sound good at all they were horrible but you know what at least, at least we're gonna get paid for it so at least that's good all right but yeah this is them rocking out to their gig i believe it's like a two-hour gig they have going on oh now now she's leaving she's like uh -huh, okay bye okay um yeah oh yeah okay so we had to perform for two hours we're probably just gonna go on ahead and speed this up a little bit just so oh, he, wants, he wants to pillow fight with her i wonder like why because i have had like most of my sims have the want to pillow fight and i'm like what is up with pillow fighting like is it like that I don't know. I mean, like, is it that, like, fun that you want to feel, feel like, oh my gosh, why, 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 why can I, like, not speak today? Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't understand, like, why they always want a pillow fight. But I guess, you know, it's, it's, oh my gosh, if it's fun for them, they can go on ahead and do it. So, oh, look at, look at him rocking out on his guitar. All right. So basically, everybody's at the same level. Um, uh, Logan and, oh, she wants a kid. Okay. Okay, she wants to kiss Jeffrey for the first time. If you guys don't know who Jeffrey is, because I can't remember, like, what I showed off camera and what I showed, or I'm sorry, like, like, what I showed on camera and, like, what I did off camera. But anyway, we had to become um, friends with Jeffrey. Oh, that girl's, like, in love with Logan. You know, like, Logan needs to find somebody who, like, he can turn to a vampire and they can have, like, a cute little vampire family. That's what we should do later on. I mean, it's only part eight, but, you know um yeah like i'm not in a hurry to get anybody in this lp like you know like in a relationship settle down i mean like i know that lydia and um blaine are in a relationship but i don't think it's gonna be like a serious serious relationship okay great playing be sure to talk to ruben blackburn to get paid yes we will want to get paid be like um excuse me where's my cash because i played at your venue and nobody was here to listen to it but i want my money please um anyway who jeffrey is it um he is he is he's part of her opportunity because she had to become friends with him to like kind of um like to up her like celebrity level i guess even though like it did, it did nothing for her um but anyway like they got to talking and he has a wife like guys he is married i don't know what it is with my sims and like wanting to like oh my gosh like that we got 1100 millions sweet but i don't know what it is about my sims and like this lp where like everybody wants to like date somebody or like kiss somebody or like do anything with anybody who's like already married like guys calm down i mean seriously like where are you like wh what i don't understand like can't you guys like just pick like a single fish in the sea and just you know be like oh you seem nice but no like we have blaine who's like you know making out with emmy star even though like, and her husband's like right there like seriously settle down okay then we have lydia who's like going after you know like like trying to date um emmy's husband i'm just like whoa calm down and now we have scarlet and i thought scarlet would be like the innocent one of the bunch but no apparently she's not now she wants to date jeffrey or like kiss jeffrey and jeffrey's married and but i mean to her defense jeffrey was kind of like you know he was giving her flowers he was kind of like you know he he was making the effort like i did not want them to date because i don't really like the way he looks to be honest i feel like he's like not her type but he was like giving her flowers he was like you know oh my gosh um he was like giving her um 
like these flirtatious jokes and everything. I'm just like, buddy, like your wife is like right next to you. And then she gets mad at us. I'm like, excuse me. Like we are doing nothing. We are just came over here to become friends. And he's like all over the place. Anyway, anyway, Ruben Blackburn is so glad they gave Unstoppable a shot. Oh my gosh, that band name. Um, Customers have never been so vocal about any other musician. Um, Okay, so sweet. Surprise cameo. Yes, we'll go ahead and do that. Um, we will go cameo in our film right now. So yeah, hopefully, um, we can actually get some more gigs because that'd be like amazing. I mean, like, you know, like maybe like a gig every week or something at like different bar locations. I think that would be so much fun. But yeah, and I've been noticing that we have been actually like getting in, like, but we've been getting a lot of simoleons and it's because of all of our opportunities that we have and, um, everything like I feel like Blaine is bringing in like the most money out of everybody just because he is a level four um celebrity star level and so that's why we have a lot of lot of money um and I don't really want them to get a house quite yet just because um you know I mean it's late night it's not like it's all about apartment life and I did find an apartment and I'm probably going to go on ahead and decorate it off camera um but yeah I just move people out of it and everything so so yeah, I feel like we're just going to move into a different apartment just because we're not really ready to settle down. Like, I mean, they don't have kids or anything. And I feel like they're just not going to, you know, like find a house, um, like anytime soon. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and watch him play shuffleboard and like, not going to lie. I'm actually like, I'm okay at shuffleboard. Like I'm not the best, but I'm like, I could get it on the board. I am like, okay, I am good at like the Wii version. I know it's like who plays the Wii anymore, but like when I used to play the Wii, I was actually like pretty decent at shuffleboard. Now, if I can, okay, shuffleboard and like baseball, I was like actually pretty good at, but like when it came to like throwing like darts and everything, oh my gosh, like don't even count on me to like get a good score. I was horrible at darts. I was, okay, to give an example, when I would play like the Wii, I don't, I forgot like what, what party, it was like a party thing and you could like play darts and everything. I like, okay, like the little like dart thing, like the dart, the dart board, oh my gosh, the dart board would be in front of me and like my dart would like go behind me and it would like go into the audience and I was like, I am so sorry for like, I don't know what happened to my dart. But anyway, yeah, I am horrible at darts like in real life and in the Wii. So yeah, like, I don't, like, how does that happen? Like your care, okay, like the wee person is like in the front of the wee board and my dart like goes behind them. Like the logic, seriously, like how, how does that even happen? Anyway, okay, so we have Jeffrey right here. He just like, like happens to be standing right here. So let's go on ahead. Oh, he's angry. The director, oh my gosh, 5,000 simoleons. That's a, lot of, that's a lot of cash. Um, The director was very grateful for your help. Wait till you, oh my gosh, wait till, see, look, look at him. He is like all about it and everything. I mean, like, you know, the reason why their relationship level is so high is because like he kept flirting with her. Oh my gosh, look at her leggings. <gasps> Stop, that is his daughter. Oh my gosh, because his last name is Cook and like that's his daughter right there. He's like, dad, what are you doing? Oh my God. I, like, feel so bad. We're, like, breaking up a family, but, like, yet, like, she's still going. Oh, my God. Okay. She's, like, what? You know what? I would, like, run away and, like, run home. If this was happening, I'd be, like, oh, my gosh. Like, I couldn't watch this. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, maybe, like, okay. You know what? Oh, no. She wants to woohoo with Jeffrey and she wants to kiss him. Oh, my gosh. Scarlett, you're, like, oh, my gosh. Apparently, like, my Sims like like the difficult people who like they are not gonna have a chance with at all and like yet the difficult like people who are married and everything they're just like you know all for it so I don't know if it's like our sims that are like you know what he has commitment issues oh my gosh <sighs> okay all right well I don't know if it's like this town that's just kind of like you know willing to do like anything or if our sims are just like you know Oh, she's sending an autograph. Or if it's just like our Sims who are just, you know, have really bad taste in people. Like, why? Like, seriously, this is our third Sim out of four who have like fallen for somebody who's already married. Oh my gosh. Okay, apparently Logan's like the only decent one out of his entire group of people. Like, seriously, like, I mean, his daughter was right there, like right behind him. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, apparently she's gonna go ahead and just keep, you know, ruining the Stanley's life. So 
yeah, we're probably gonna go on ahead and, oh my gosh, okay, we are probably going to go on ahead and break them up um, in the next part, probably, you know what we'll do, we'll have like a couple's night, so we'll have like um, Blaine and Emmy, and then we'll have Lydia and Alan, and then we'll have Scarlett and Jeffrey, like, you know, go to like a club, and then we'll see like who was like, oh my gosh, then we'll see like who is the last couple standing. Dun, 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 dun. Alrighty, well, oh my gosh, buddy. I don't know what happened to my, oh my gosh, look at her outfit behind there. Oh my gosh, she's like walking towards us and everything. She's like looking at us too, like, oh my gosh, what is going on out here? It's gonna look away. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Jeffrey's dating Scarlett. Oh my gosh, okay, yeah, okay, that girl in the background is kind of actually like really scary. But anyway, I don't know what happened to my voice a few seconds ago. <sighs> I honestly, I don't even know, guys. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore, like, with this, like, like with them dating and everything. I don't really even think I want them to date. So, you know what? Next part, they're going to they're gonna go to the club. We're just going to see who the last couple standing is going to be. It'll be like a game show. It'll be like a game show. And I will actually, I will title that part, last couple standing, and then we'll have, like, set up, like, a game show. Oh, <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so, um, okay. See, look, he's like into it, and then he's not. I don't understand him. Anyway, yeah. Next part's gonna be like a game show. I am now. I'm excited because we're like last couple standing. Like, let's meet the couples. Oh, <gasps> you guys, I am so excited. Next part, it's gonna be amazing. Like, honestly, it's gonna be good. Okay, there's gonna be like a lot of like chipmunk voices in there too, probably. But you know, it'll be okay. It'll be okay because like. I'll use, Oh, yes, because I'll use like the video auditing or like like the audio like editing thing and like make my voice sound like an announcer. Oh my gosh, you know what, guys? I am excited. Okay, I am so excited for part nine. Okay, well, I'm gonna go on ahead. Okay, she's gonna propose, go and say to him. Oh my gosh, let's go and see. Like, look at his nose. It's so point. Oh no. All right, well, anyway, now every single person. Oh my gosh, did she gain a celebrity star level? I think she did. Maybe she didn't. Um. Okay, well, I guess we're going to just keep being romantic, but I think I am going to actually end this part um, in a little bit. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. He's like so old and he's like a little like pointy nose and everything. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I'm actually going to go after I end this part, I'm going to get some cold medicine because like I said, um, in my pets LP, because I am filming like, I'm doing the audio for three or four different videos today. So yeah, like I said in my pets um, video, I'm actually like really, or I'm getting sick and my nose is all like stuffed up and everything. So actually after I film this part, I'm going to go on ahead and like get some DayQuil because all of a sudden I'm just like getting so sick and it's so not fun. So yeah, it's like that. Oh, maybe we can mooch a large amount of money. Ooh, let's see what he says. Are you going to help us out there, buddy? I mean, we don't really need it, but let's go and see what he says. He's like, yeah, sure. Here you go. Or if he's like, no. Oh my gosh, he has big ears too. He's like a big ear. Oh my gosh no why won't you help oh my gosh look at that guy I was like a must okay it's like wait a minute I gotta run over here and get a picture he, oh, you know what he needs to shave that mustache off I mean sir. he's like oh he's like like you know this is a couple all right you guys I am gonna go ahead and end this part here I hope you guys all enjoyed now he's being a jerk but anyway I hope you guys all enjoyed if you did please feel free to give this video a thumbs up and yeah I love you guys all so much I'll see you guys all in the next part bye guys Hey guys, and thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to, don't forget to subscribe. Hope you guys all enjoyed. I love you guys all so much. And I will see you guys all in the next video. Bye guys.